basically it's just like messages, you know, that I want to leave behind. And like sound-wise, I guess just really going back to my roots and uh, spending that time to really get in touch with myself living in the forest. I guess the biggest inspiration behind it would be the nature. It's really amazing to have that support from my moon children. There are other ways, there are other ways of, of making art than just like the, the, the paved path. When you're like a child and you play and then too many adults get involved and start, you know, coming up with all these rules for you, you just kind of like forget how to play. So I had to go back to the forest and like learn how to play again. I went with two suitcases and one of it was my studio and one of it was basically like two pairs of sweatpants. And I lived like that with nothing for like nine months and I realized that I don't really even need anything. To me it was like, uh, you know, you could go and like live in like a temple for a year or you could go and live in a forest, whatever. Like it's the same thing, it's like soul search. I think everybody who's been following my journey and has been feeling connected to these vibrations that I create, I think it is like the most honest art I've ever created.